na mahali unatumiaga unakosa kukasirikia watu unajua this is my understand your lifestyle and understand your type if you want to conquer in life improve your lifestyle and understand your your type semeni finishing well Philippians 1:6 Amen waraka wa Paulo kwa Filipi mlango wa kwanza mstari wa sita. Nami niliamilialo ndilo hili ya kwamba ye alianza kazi njema mioyoni mwenu ataimaliza hata siku ya Yesu Kristo. Amen. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Mimi nasema huyu ni watu kanisa. Wakati kanisa iliinukiwa sana na kukawa na ugumu na ushi, na, na ugovi mwingi. Paulo alikuja akawatia watu moyo. Na akawaambia, "Mnaona kama katika hii imani kama amtaendelea. Bible inasema ya, ya kwamba nyinyi sio nyinyi mlijiita na nyinyi sio nyinyi mlijiokoa. Nyinyi sio wewe ulianza hiyo kazi. Kuna wengi wameisomea, kuna wengi wametaka kuishi uhai. Paulo anataka kuambia finishing well. Labda uko mahali hapa, Mungu alikupatia idea ya doa. Mungu alikupatia idea ya ya ya, ya, ya yo kazi. Mungu alikupatia hata kama kuna mambo mengi. Hata kama kuna changamoto. Hata kama kuna upigamizi. Anajaribu kuwaambia, let me tell you people. Alioanza kazi ndani yenu ana uwezo wa kuikamilisha. Ju Mungu hajawahi anza kitu ikaisha. Shida ile iko ni ukue na doubt. Na kama alianza kwako hata kama wewe utafujika moyo atairifaa kwa mtoto wako ama ilifae kwa relative The only problem tuko naye it is the time tunakosa courage Unajua tuna tunawini katika kiroho through points Why do tuko kwa kanisa moja wengine wamebarikiwa na wengine wako na mko na pasta moja kanisa moja anoitengi moja Hapana Mungu hana shida na wewe ana hesabu point. Ya, dio naona wengine wako juu, wengine chini. Pasta mwingine anatuko kwa pasta moja. Kristo moja na hawaonyeshi nini? Kile kiko matendo ile unafanya kwa Mungu. Mungu ana account in points. Mungu ana account kwa point. Wanasapata mshirika amekaa pale. Hata haogeagi, lakini maneno yale yanateda bigu inaongeza point. Point. Unabana kuna mtu hapa mwaka umeisha Haka una pointi tano Mwigine haka una miabiri Hata amepitisha hande li parasent Let me show you for instance Ok, watu wana wanaedesha uba Kuna four star Three star Mtu wako na five star Watu wana wa uba Ukiakisha api yako hapa Utashukua haraka Di unaona mweza kuwa gari nyigi za uba Simeka hapa Simeka we unaona mtu mmoja ameingia, ame drop, ameenda, ako na pointi nyingi katika hiyo department. So atapata kazi haraka. Hivi ndivyo naye bigu iko. Kuna mtu hapa akinua mkono hivi anapata upenyo. Juma raika wake wako na pointi nyingi. Neema nyingi. Tuko na Kristo moja na roho moja na, na ni moja. Lakini matendo yako katika Bwana ndio inakuogezeaga point. Kutoa kwako si pesa unatoa Matoleo ile unatoa leo uko kwa TV umetuma mingine ametoa lakini madhabahu ile yako inajua Bible inasema napajua mahali uka yako kuna Mkristo ananitazama hapa hata roho hajui mahali uka yako hajui madhabahu yako ni yako We umejoea kanisa kama hii imejaa watu wengi hata ukifanya dhambi huwezi onekana hata ukiiba hata ukiogea mambo tutakuona leo sadi hiyo ingine kuna mtu kila mwezi kila wiki leo niko kanisa fulani umeregister Laze. Hata baibu haijui mahali Hata bigu haijui mahali uka ako Ili baraka yako itumu wapare <laughs> Do you know It's not everywhere that you get blessing Let me tell you Look at me It's not all women are your mothers It's not all men that are your fathers It's not all pastors are your pastor Spiritual authorizer You must understand Who authorize Ogesa pointi zako Di wacha kupigia mungu kerere Jua mahali pale unafaa kuogezea pointi zako. Dio mumeeka mungu jera. Yes, atukatai. Miujiza itatadeka. But are you glowing? 
Unajua majaribu yingine unaona unapitia God anataka kujua why do you love me God aise kwa hapo akuulize why you say mimi nampenda Yesu ni bwana siku moja atakuletea hata kuja hapa akuulize atakuletea kinoma pa Alafu aone unampenda kwa nini why do you love me na kama unasema you love Jesus number one, let me tell you ni lazima chochote kilicho hapa duniani akiondoe kwako ili pesa isikue nyingi kuliko yeye juli confess shida ile iko ni kwa sababu muna mnadaganya roho mnasema i love jesus i love you jesus i love you i love you i love you okay sawa umesema hivyo hiyo why do you love me mimi naomba mtu wote aliyo hapa the reason why you love jesus the time atakuja kusimama na wewe akuuliza swali you will be able to answer So there is so many things Paulo akawa encourage church akamwambia don't mind alioanza dawa hiyo alioanza hiyo biashara alioanza kazi ile ana uwezo wa kuimalizia na amani aliokupatia hiyo idea ukweli ukiona ujasiri atakuja kumalizi maybe eh? ni ile uli confess i love you jesus anataka kujua ili ya kuogesee point and it will make you finishing well. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Na ndipo unapata msomi mmoja wa dunia ni Lisacha. Akatuambia in the book of Muhubiri saba mistari ya nane. Amen. Kitabu cha Muhubiri mlango wa saba, mstari wa nane. Heri mwisho wa neno kuliko mwanzo wake na mvumilivu rohoni kuliko mwenye roho ya kiburi. God bless you. In the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse 8 it says the end of anything is better than its beginning patience is better than pride God bless you Abadali mwisho wa jambo kwa hivyo kila kitu ile unaona iko kama uko na uchungu mwingi utakuwa na mwisho Bible inasema afadhali mwisho wa kitu Na leo ninaoba labda unatamani mwisho hii wa mwaka uishe ati ilikuwa na kisirani hapana mwaka utaisha lakini si mwisho wako nataka kama ni mabaya uone mwisho wa mabaya yako kama kuna jambo ulianza naomba uone bwana yesu apewe sifa simuachilie mambo yote mmebeba mwaka mzima simuiachilie yote iende na hewa muone mtakuwa na uvumilifu simuondoe kila mtu wote mmebeba mwaka mzima hii siku tano ili jehova mungu wetu amalizie vyema pokeni neema in jesus name Hallelujah. Sema alioanza kasi jema ndani yangu. Atakuja kumalizia. Praise the living God. Amen. Mi naamini ya kwamba kila mmoja aliyofanya kasi jema atakuja. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. I pray today vile unaitwa Bwana akubali kukuita jina jema. Na atakaze mabaya yote usije ukaitwa vibaya in Jesus name. Amen. Second Timothy ndio itafuga naye mistari ya ine na saba. Uh, uh, second Timothy 4:7. Paulo anasema nimepiga na vita. Na sasa uh-huh. kitabu cha Timothy wa pili mlango wa ine mstari wa saba. Nimevipiga vita vilivyo vizuri. Mwendo nimeumaliza. Imani nimeilinda. God bless you. Hiyo si ya mtu amekufa ni ya mtu wote ameachieve na kwa ready to achieve. Leo ninataka mtu wako hapa asiambiwe hii mwaka ilikuwa baya. Uligojeka sana lakini hujakufa. Hata kama umepigana mwendo umemaliza salama. Ulipilisika sana umeishi mwaka mzima. Hiccup under pressure. Accusation. Kila kitu 2023 hautaiprovoke because anytime you provoke in stage of arrive you spoil it any time you provoke you criticize the stage of your life you spoil it but every time you appreciate every stage of your life you uplift it quote that leo nigeritaka hii mwendo wakati wote utakachifu age ama stage ya mwaka yako unasema nilikuwa teenager 
nilijispoilu sana yeye nilipokuwa mzee yeye miaka pote nilipokuwa mama yangu hakunilea vizuri hiyo itaishi kileta reverence baya leo ningelitaka 2023 2023 isiwe ya kwamba umeika chifu hata kama umenyang'anywa kila kitu hata kama umepigana nini ningelitaka ndani yako hata kama ilikuwa nzito kwako umelala wodi umenyang'anywa kazi umepigwa sana lakini huja kufa Unapa ujirudishie shukurani na mugu wako Paolo alipitia challenge nyingi lakini he never any time provoke the stage of his life Leo nigeritaka ujue u appreciate how old are you u appreciate your miaka because labda ume mess up because each and every year each and every stage of your life you criticize it and the time you criticize the stage of your or anything you criticize something belong to you it will never give you a service leo nigeritaka mtu alio hapa timotheo wa pili 4 useme ukweli nilikuwa karibu kuaguka you need to understand this here maybe you fail because you have a very sweet friend sweet friend whereby you are not going in the same direction it is very dangerous maybe you have very sweet hawana maono ya doa kazi yenu ni kuja nikiogea mambo ya wanaume na wanawake eh wacha na wanaka ukiona anakaa hivyo ukiona amekaa hivyo ukiona anakaa hivyo si bibi ukiona amekaa hivi tumununulie guo kuna material imekuja watoto tulipia school fees kanisa hii mkikaa na sweet friend that you are not going to the same direction let me tell you hautamaliza mwendo salama unafahamu waka ukiisha uandike mahali kweli nimejeruhiwa sana lakini sijapoteza imani na sitapoteza doa sijapoteza uhai mwendo nimemaliza salama nilikuwa mwaka wangu unajiinamisha you recommend yourself say I must recommend myself. You are tomorrow is determined with your recommendation. Listen very careful. Your future is determined with your recommendation. Not others recommendation. Not your mother's recommendation. Not your pastor recommendation. Your future is dependent with your recommendation. Hata kama hauna pesa kwa mfuko hata kama huna chochote sema mwendo nimemaliza kwa mwaka huu si kufa hii barua haikuwa ya kufa haikuwa kukufa kwa paolo paolo alikuwa mzee na akasema wao ujana wangu nimemalizia vizuri na imani nimechunga amen leo ni gelioba labda umechunga watoto imani hujachunga umechunga pesa hujachunga wokovu Vitu tatu ni lazima chuka maisha yako take care of yourself take care of Christ Jesus take care about others are you together at that time utagalia ya kwaba utasema kweli second team of the 47 nimevipiga vita semeni nimeshika mkono wa right sema nimeipiga vita nimeipiga vita sema nimeipiga vita Aha mwendo nimeumaliza mwendo sema mwendo nimeumaliza Aha imani nimeilinda imani nimeilinda Aha Amen nimevipiga vita vilivyo vizuri mwendo nimeumaliza imani nimeilinda Pokeni neema Pokeni neema hata kama umepitia bando umeokoka bado uko na nyumba yako bado uko uhai kwa hiyo siku ya leo your recommendations is more important in your life your future in a depend the way you recommend yourself before we tell your story before to tell stories zako future yako kesho yako it a depend recommendation ile umejiandikia imani ile umeleada you may finish well pokeni neema kwa jina la Yesu Kristo na leo nikilitaka mtu ajiandikie recommendation ya kwamba I'll finish well. 
Doa zetu zitasimama kwa jina la Yesu Kristo. Watoto wetu watafanikiwa in Jesus name. Mwendo wa watoto wetu itamalizika vizuri. Pokeni neema in Jesus name. Huduma itaendelea in Jesus name. Amen. Sema nimeipiga vita. Mwendo nimemalizia. Ah, na imani nimerida. Amen. So from today everybody ananipata. Hata adika ulikuwa mwaka mbaya. Finishing well so that you may start well. When you finish any stage well, you will start well. Amen. Pokeni neema in Jesus name. Pokeni ushidi in Jesus name. Mtu wote alikuwa amejitukia, kuna watu wamekufa tulianza na wao. Kuna watu waliferi. Kuna watu wako wodi, lakini wewe Bwana amekusaidia. Pokeni neema in Jesus name. Baba wa biguni bariki kila moja hata wasikilizaji walio hapa. Bwana ukawapatie neema na ushidi. Neema ya kushida na kushida. Ukawapatie neema. Baba vile wanajirikomed ukawasaidie. Tunaamini ya kwamba tumemaliza mwendo wa kila hatua. Sasa hizi ni samani tunafanya. Baba ubariki wa malizie mwaka wa 2023 vizuri. Na bwana wakianza 2024. Bwana iyo mwaka ikuwe ya amani. Isikuwe kuna mahali wataishi wakisema kulifanyika vibaya. Bwana wabiguni asante kwa kuogezea uhai, asante kwa kuwarida, hata bwana wabiguni wala taanza kwenda siku kuku. Ninaomba baraka ya ushidi katika jina la Yesu. Sikiliza msikilizaji aliyo mahali pale, ukampatie ushidi na mamlaka. In Jesus name.